Mm. 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 Coffee. Wow, ah, coffee. Coffee. Oh, and I'd like to have a smell of the, uh, yeah, the, the beans. beans. Current it. That, that's a okay. smell. There's a current taste yeah. smell to it. Black currants. Black currants. <laughs> there absolutely is, and there's a taste as well. There's something. There's a fruity black currant. The acidity, uh, sort of acidity. But also oh, yeah. in the fragrance as well. In the, no, in the, in the smell, I can smell black currants. It's quite sort of a refreshing coffee. I don't think I'd want to add milk to this. I think you'd no, use the yeah, no, delicacy no. of it. Just Even nice iced flavor. actually would be quite nice and refreshing. I think if you had it as an iced coffee. It would yeah. be quite nice. It's nice and light. I think yeah. it's a it's a reviving coffee in it, not just because it's got caffeine in it or whatever, but it's because it's because it's actually the flavour is quite refreshing. Let's see what we got. Um, Panama La Abuela Cafe de Panama by Dark Woods Coffee, and it won the Golden Fork from the north of England. Uh, founded in 2013, Darkwoods Coffee is a coffee roaster, barista school and pop-up cafe nestled on the edge of Marsden Village in the West Yorkshire Pennines. The coffee was sun-dried and hand-processed. Specialty-grade coffees um, have cleaner, more distinctive flavours than cheaper commercial coffees. I mean, I understand that. I think that there is a clean... There's a, a cleanness, clean yeah. It. Absolutely. The process isn't hasn't overtaken the kind of raw materials. Mm. You're still tasting the raw materials a lot, aren't you? Rather than the, the processing of them so much. No, I think that's right. And I think it's a coffee that, if you want that sort of lighter style, that's going to be there. Yeah, yeah. That's going to be for you. I think for me in um, Casimir, obviously, we know that the way of coffee has become really serious now. And I remember there was a time we were using like Nespresso. And it was like the, the coffee pods. Mm. Um, and we realised, damn it, we need to actually go into the coffee world. We need to really explore it. And now filter coffee is becoming more and more popular at the end of the meal because I think it's quite light. Mm. Instead of having an espresso, you can actually have a drink of coffee and f feel, I don't know, a little bit more fulfilled mm. having a cup of coffee rather than just a little espresso shot. And for me, this is like, this is perfect way to just end the meal. Mm.